Excellent. Good morning. This is Javier here to show you how to screen record on your MacBook computer with QuickTime and a program called Soundflower. So if that's what you came here for, that's what we're gonna learn. Open up your browser and look for a program called Soundflower. You download Soundflower free and it says it's a safe download. So you know it's safe. No Mac keeper getting up in this. Alternative download, downloading, there, I have it. Now what you do, sorry for the mess on my screen, you click, you verify, finish, right click here. How you right click on a Mac is hold control and click, open with installer, is unidentified developer, yes. So what Mac does when you first get a package from the internet that isn't from the Mac store is it goes through a security precaution where you have to control click it or right click it and open in order to uh, install it. My Soundflower is already installed so I'm gonna see what happens if I just do this. I can't screen record and do this at the same time. I'm gonna move my camera now to showcase my computer. All right, so now that you have your computer up, you go look up QuickTime Player. You go to File, Screen Recording. Here you will see a drop down menu for what is going into QuickTime. Now normally this is going to default to your microphone and you can see when I'm hitting it, that's my internal microphone. That's not what we want to screen record. We want to actually pick up the sound that's inside the computer. So what you do is you go to your sound over here, option click it, and go to sound preferences. Another way to get to that point is go to System Preferences, Sound. And now that you have Soundflower installed, you have this Soundflower two channel. So we wanna to go to Output, and instead of your normal output internal speakers, we go to Soundflower two channel. Now the computer is, its output of anything you listen to on the computer is going to be going to Soundflower, not to your speakers. Now you go to Input, the microphone to be Soundflower, channel right here and we hit record on the screen recording it says hey where do you want to screen record I want to screen record this whole thing so just to prove to you that we're recording inside let's go ahead and check out Javier Mercedes YouTube channel because that's a cool place to hang out and subscribe if you like his content you could probably already hear what's going on there but let's click on something else let's click on this video there you could watch my nephew wrestle other kids to your heart's delight if you wanted to. Look at how cool that is. He just got a pin. Boom, putting him down. Next thing you do is you go up to the stop button and there's your screen recording. Go to file, file bark and you bark. Go to file export as cool video I recorded. Save and don't forget to when you're done, go to your sound preferences and change your output back to external speakers and double click, cool video, and here we go. And there you go. That's how you screen record on a Mac internally with the sound. Hey, Briley, you wanna say, hey, could you subscribe and like Javier's material? Subscribe Javier's. There you go.